I would be a completely different person if I wasn't doing art. I actually came at art a little later, and it was like I came home. It was introduced without really much testing the idea of the ritual. All of my work has been about changing technologies and how they alter how we mediate our world. Bite, use it, break it, junk it, scrap it, chip it, pound it, scrap it, dump it, pile it, scratch it, dump it, lump it, chunk it, dump it. It's not the technology itself that stimulates me, it's the ideas that I'm working with. One of the things that really drew me to working with responsive works or environments is making the viewer complicit in the work and the issues that I was thinking about. That was one of the first things I was aware of that I was trying to do by starting to work with digital media. I've actually taken quite a few risks. I mean, the kind of work that I make and people like me make, that we're really making prototypes. Um, and so whether they're going to work or whether they're not going to work is kind of up in the air. I've had work that's never worked. I've made work that never really came to fruition for some reason or other too. And sometimes it just takes a really long time to get them to work. And sometimes the actual technology can't do your idea. I've taken a lot of chances. I'm really comfortable not knowing what I'm doing. And I kind of, it's a really creative, interesting place for me to be over my head, technically and even conceptually. Uh, I find that very exciting. The challenges. I really like the challenges.